Development in the case of a Botetourt County woman who was cycling along Lee Highway last year when she was hit and killed by an SUV. 10 News reporter Sydney Jacksheimer working for you to explain the outcome in a wrongful death suit. Tabitha Thompson's husband, Matt, will receive a $1.5 million settlement. The money coming from the driver, Danielle Rock's insurance company, and the number agreed upon is her full liability coverage. Over a year after Tabitha Thompson was hit and killed, court records show the driver, Danielle Rock, and her insurance company filed a petition for a judge to approve a wrongful death settlement in the amount of $1.5 million. Tabitha's husband, Matt Thompson, says a Roanoke City judge approved the settlement on Tuesday. He released a statement to 10 News saying, We won't allow Tab's light to be fully extinguished. Her communities came together and demonstrated the enormous impact of one tiny person. Today, we'll continue to carry that light in hopes to be the movement that alters the driving culture in our region. Thompson's defense attorney, John Lichtenstein, released a statement saying, This was a horrible tragedy and a completely needless loss. The success of this legal case is only there to help. We also reached out to Rock's attorney, Andrew Garish, who says he has no comment about the settlement. Coming up tonight on 10 News at 11, hear from Matt Thompson and how he hopes the community can help keep Tabitha's light alive. In Roanoke, I'm Sydney Jacksheimer, 10 News, working for you.